You know, I've been fishing tournaments all my life, uh, 20 years as a BASS pro, and you know, our, our boat is the most important thing. Our boat and our engine is the most important tool that we have. You know, there's a lot of tools that we use, rods, reels, hooks, line, you know, lots of things. But, but the, the outboard engine and the boat are, are the most important. And, you know, I, I was led to Phoenix Boat primarily because the people that, that started the company and the people that work at that, at that company are people that I've known for, for a long, long time, you know. Gary and Hank, Teresa, you know, there's people that's been in the industry. They, uh, they're good people. Uh, they're smart people. They're great boat builders. Uh, and, and that's what led me to Phoenix Boats. And, and then once, once I was attracted to those people, then I started looking at the boat closely and I saw the quality and I saw the workmanship and I saw they were not cutting corners. Uh, and it's just a boat that, that, that I'm really proud to be in. You know, I've had the opportunity to ride in every pretty much every major boat brand out there in a bass boat. And uh, bar none, I, you know, I'm gonna just be real frank with you, this is the finest riding bass boat that I've ever been in. And I, like I said before, I've been in every brand there is out there. Another thing that suits me about it, I don't like a boat that drifts around. When I get off the trolling motor, I want the boat to stop. This boat does that, it doesn't float around like a cork. I don't want every time I take my foot off the trolling motor, or I stop for a second that the boat blows around. You know, and a, and a lot of that is, a lot of the boats out there today weigh about the same amount, but it's the way they distribute the weight in the boat that make how it sits in the water. It's the reason it rides so good, because everything is perfect. This boat was designed by a fisherman. There's no wasted space in it. Everything in it is set up, ready to go. Uh, my problem, one of my top features of the boat, or one of the things I like the most, would be uh, the fishability of the boat, um, the way it performs in the water. I mean, it, it handles and it's fast. For as big as my boat is, 921, it's really fast, but the thing that amazes me the most is how well it, it fishes. Like when you're on the water and you have a partner in the back or you have a camera guy that's jumping around behind you, it's like you, you don't move anymore. It's like he, I mean, not enough to even throw you off at all. It's like you don't care anymore. And that's, that's the part to me, that's what we're doing most of the time is actually fishing it. That's the part to me that's uh, the most impressive. Probably the best feature of the Phoenix is the layout of the boat. I mean, you know, this boat was built by a fisherman and all the compartments don't, none of the compartments leak, they're all dry. The middle compartment is set up for Plano boxes. If you want to just take everything out and take a water hose and wash it out, you can do that. I mean, it's very convenient. There's an absolutely no wasted space in this boat. The ride's good, it's a fast boat, it's a good looking boat. It fishes great. Um, so everything on this boat is for, for a tournament angler and, and that's why I choose it. The biggest thing in the boat for me is the little tackle organizer on the side. Because normally I've got a floor full of scissors and pliers and they've got under stuff and I can't find them. And so I just, at the beginning of every fishing day, I stuff that organizer full of scissors and pliers. Now by the end of the day, there may be one pair left in there. Because I've got them out and didn't put them back. But it's just uh, simple things like that. You know, one of the reasons I, did, I switched to Phoenix Boats and, and looking real forward to the future is I'm a shallow water guy. I like to get out there, get shallow, but I like to get up quick and I like to run fast. And when I saw the features that Phoenix Boats offered, they have a, a 920, which I'll be running next year with a Yamaha Show 250 on it. I'll be putting a Bob's Jack plate. I'll get that boat up in less than two foot of water, foot and a half, foot six. That's important to me. And when it's top end time, when I need to get to a spot before anybody else, I want the power to do it. And I have been in a 920 Phoenix and ran 75, 76 miles an hour and felt very, very comfortable with the speed. So it's, it's little things like that that I look for in a boat. I want durability. I need something to get me to where I'm going quick. And when I feel, when I'm in the boat, I want to be as comfortable as possible. And Phoenix has all those options for me. You know, when you look at a bass boat and you're a tournament fisherman, there's three things that, that you really need to consider in my opinion. Uh, we're all competitive, so you want a boat that's fast. Uh, you want a boat that rides good, rides well in rough water. And then fishability. You want a boat that, that you just feel good when you're standing up on the front deck, it's balanced out, the wind doesn't swing it around on the front, those sort of things. But all three of those factors, I don't know of another boat on the market that has a combination that the, that the Phoenix boat has with speed, ride, and fishability. That's what drew me to Phoenix Boat, and that's why I love being in a Phoenix Boat. 
Um, you know, the, the main overall thing is, is that boat is, is really fisherman friendly. You know, Gary Klaus, he, you know, he's a fisherman just like all of us, a tournament fisher, fisherman and he's really good at it. And he knows how we want these boats laid out. He knows that, you know, that this plier rack, for instance, you know, it's right there, it's handy. We can get our pliers and tools. He knows where the cooler needs to go. He knows how the boxes need to be laid out. He, you know, he's just a great boat builder, but he knows, he knows how the fisherman wants that boat set up. You know, and also the performance of the boat. They, you know, they cut on a dime. I've never been in a softer ride. The hulls are really efficient and they're just, they're just absolutely just fun to drive. Again, I'm going, this is another thing I think Phoenix has over every other, I'll go out on a limb and say there's not another bass boat out there that looks better. These boats look like Corvettes. They look like race cars. They ride good, they're fast, they're stable. They're very safe boats. And uh, of course I've known Gary, we're, we had mutual friends in the past and, and I went to the boat plant and that's when I knew this is the boat I want to be in. The, the time that was taken to, to build that boat, the people that were there that actually built the boats in the, in the uh, back in the shop, I mean, they, they knew what they were doing. There's a lot of experience here at Phoenix Boats and I knew that that's the people I wanted to be with from now on. You know, from the first time that I saw the Phoenix, um, I really fell in love with the looks of the boat. Uh, it just had a real sleek sports car type look to it. And uh, obviously that's what first attracted me to the boat is the, is the visual uh, effects that it has. And then, uh, then I was able to meet Gary and Teresa and uh, as time went on, I visited the factory and, and uh, got to meet the people there. And you know, I got to learn more about the boat and I still hadn't been in one yet. And uh, finally I was able to, to ride and drive one and uh, the ride and the crisp feel and the handling capabilities and the cornering and then the fishing capability spoke for itself. I didn't have to fish out of it. When I got up and, and walked around the front, uh, front deck where we spend most of our time and looked in the compartments of how the boat was laid out, some of the fisherman features that was built into that boat, it was very, very, very obvious to me right then. You know, uh, I work for a very tight-knit group of people that, uh, you know, I can call any time and talk to anyone there I want to talk to. Uh, they're just, you know, they're really tight niche family oriented. It, that is, you know, in today's time, you very seldom ever find a company as large as Phoenix Boats that is not corporate. You know, where you got to talk to this middle man and that middle man and this middle man and that middle man. Um, you know, another thing, Gary fishes tournaments. I mean, he's out there all the time competitively. You know, won the PAA Angler of the Year uh, this year. You know what I'm saying? I mean, you know, so it's a different deal. It's, they take care of the customer, you know, if there's any issues with the boat, anything, you know, they take care of that part, you know, they're one-on-one, -on -one. you know, you can call over there and get them on the phone and if you got any questions, any problems, whatever, they'll take care of it. And that's just hard to find today. I mean, we, we were in a fast-paced corporate world now and you just don't find that anymore.